Hi everyone, today we're going to be uh, talking about Behance, which is a creative network, the largest in the world. Uh, so we're going to go over in this presentation what it is, how you can showcase your work or explore the work of other people, and how you can use it on your phone or laptop. Uh, so firstly, what is it? So it's a social media platform that's designed to discover and showcase creative work. And it was created in 2006 and is now owned by Adobe. It allows artists, designers, photographers, and other creative professionals to create online portfolios of their work and share them with a global community. Users can upload and display their work, including illustration, graphic design, web design, photography, and more. They can also connect with other professionals, join groups, and follow other users to see their work and to receive updates. It offers a wide variety of tools and features that help users promote their work and also get discovered by potential clients, collaborators, and employers. Users can also search for job opportunities and create custom online resumes to showcase their skills and experience. Yeah, so to showcase your work on Behance, you first need to create an account on the platform. Uh, once you have an account, you can create a portfolio by adding your projects to your profile. You can upload your work as images, videos, or other file types, and also add descriptions, titles, and tags to make it easier for others to discover. The hands allows you to organize your work into collections, which can showcase your work by theme or category. You can also customize the look and feel of your portfolio by choosing a cover photo, changing the layout, and add in your own branding. You can browse the platform by different categories such as graphic design, photography, or illustration. You can also search for specific keywords or hashtags to find work that matches your interests. The Hands also offers a discover feature that recommends content based on your interests and activity. This can help you discover new artists, designers, and photographers to follow and be inspired by. Once you find work that you like, you can follow the creator, leave a comment, or appreciate their work by clicking the heart icon. This helps to build connections with other creatives on the platform and can lead to new opportunities and collaborations. To use Behance on a laptop, you can simply visit its website at www.behance.net and sign into your account. From there, you can create and edit your portfolio, browse and search for other users' work, and connect with other creatives on the platform. To use it on your phone, you can download the mobile app for iOS or Android devices. Once you have it installed, you can sign into your account and access all of the same features as the desktop version, including creating and editing your portfolio, browsing and searching for other users' work, and interacting with other users. The app also offers some additional features, such as the ability to capture and upload images of your work directly from your phone, as well as push notifications to be updated on the activity of other users that you follow. And uh, yeah, there are just some things on Behance here that we can look at if anyone is interested later. And uh, that's it for the presentation. Thank you for listening. If you have any uh, questions you, if you, or if you'd like to learn this lesson uh, directly with a Cyber Seniors mentor, you can go to www.cyberseniors.org or call 1-844-217-3057 to register for a one-on-one -on -one phone session. Uh, they're also weekly drop-in tech sessions from 2 to 3 p.m. on Thursdays if you're interested. Thank <laughs> you.